Four Iranians killed in Israel offensive on Iran. Israel hits Iran's fuel mixing facilities. Satellite photos show Israel hit Iran missile fuel mixing facilities. Commercial satellite imagery show that Israeli airstrikes hit buildings during an attack on Saturday that Iran used for mixing solid fuel for ballistic missiles, according to separate assessments by two American researchers. Ashutosh Mishra is joining us live on the broadcast for more on this. Uh, Ashutosh, uh, give us more details on what really is the extent of damage uh, uh, in Iran on the uh, ballistic missile components. And uh, in the latest that we're getting, four Iranians were also killed in the strikes. Well, in this Perchin area, in fact, uh, the first we, uh, these images that came from 2021 and the comparison by the new satellite picture suggests there's a, a significant damage to uh, Iran's missile uh, production capabilities and particularly targeting the area which was used for the mixing of uh, a solid fuel for the ballistic long-range uh, uh, missiles. And on that, this was not the first time. Even in the last airstrike, uh, the Israel's primarily target were the military uh, air bases and the military bases also include including the missiles depot, the missiles uh, ammo depot, as well as uh, the production capabilities. In fact, the four uh, air defense system were soldiers of the IRGC were also killed in this strike. But this suggests that Israel prima facie realized the major threat coming from Iran is the capabilities of firing long-range projectiles. 27 days ago, when Iran uh, responded and Iran attacked Israel, it wasn't using a fighter jet, it wasn't using a, you know, a warplanes, but it was only the long-range projectiles which travels nearly 2,000 kilometers all the way from Iran to different uh, uh, pockets of Israel. And clearly on that, on the assessment, when the Israel said it was an attempt for self-defense, uh, uh, they knew neutralize the threat which was the production capabilities but moreover these also suggest the kind of fuel mixing that the capabilities and the production quality Iran has would be some support from the Western country. Now, who are those countries? How they how they did they obtain it? That will be perhaps one subject that Israel may raise this question sooner or later. But for now, what it looks like that the significant damage and damage exactly in those areas, uh, which was the strength of Iranian military when it comes to firing projectiles is concerned. Because once you attack and target the capability, the production capabilities that will hit the bone uh, of Iran. But for now, remember Iran also one of the most powerful military in the Middle East uh, have not one or uh, the two or three or just uh, a few dozens of such bases they have uh, multiple such bases and many are believed to be underneath up nearly uh, uh, 50 to 60 meter uh, from the surface so on that this looks like one major achievement by Israel whereas the Iran also said that almost all the projectiles fired by uh, Israeli warplanes were neutralized by air defense system but there have been damage which has been assist, assessed by the commercial uh, satellite imagery and also the killing of their four IRGC Jaman on the military bases, three particular military bases that were targeted including in one in Tehran. Right, thanks Ashutosh for bringing us all those details.